This video is an introduction to primordial prevention of group A streptococcal infections, which can cause acute rheumatic fever. Information is derived from the 2020 Australian Guideline for Prevention, Diagnosis and Management of Acute Rheumatic Fever and Rheumatic Heart Disease, 3rd edition. The learning objectives are to define primordial prevention and Describe strategies that address community-based transmission of Group A streptococcal infection. The social determinants of health within an Australian Indigenous cultural context have profound impacts on health and well-being. The circumstances in which people live affect the risk of strep A infections, ARF and RHD. Primordial prevention strategies are focused on the prevention of risk factors and generally address the social determinants of health that increase the risk of strep A disease. The aim of primordial prevention is to stop strep A infection. Nine healthy living practices were developed in the 1980s by the Nanampa Health Council in South Australia and can be used to associate the ways people live with the risk of strep A infections. The nine healthy living practices are Washing people, hands and bodies Washing clothes and bedding Removing wastewater safely Improving nutrition The ability to store, prepare and cook food Reducing the negative impacts of overcrowding Reducing the negative impacts of animals, insects and vermin Reducing the health impacts of dust Controlling the temperature of the living environment. Reducing hazards that cause trauma. While not all these practices apply directly to preventing strep A infections, the approach to the social determinants of health should be holistic rather than disease specific. Evidence suggests that washing hands and bodies and reducing the negative impacts of crowding are directly associated with reducing strep A infections. Washing hands and bodies is directly associated with reducing strep A infection. Access to water, working taps and sinks, soap and clean towels are required for effective washing. Social beliefs about hygiene practices or health behaviours may also influence washing. So strategies to promote effective hand and body washing should be developed by the local community to suit local priorities and preferences. Strep A is a human-only infection with no animal or insect hosts. However, animal and insect bites and scratches and abrasions from rubbish and debris around the home and community can cause skin damage that can encourage Strep A skin infection. Washing clothes, bedding and towels can reduce the transmission of scabies, mites and lice which can cause skin damage. Crowded living means that large numbers of people are living in confined environments with limited household resources. Strep A transmission from person to person is increased when there is crowded living and especially if poorly maintained housing conditions make good hygiene difficult. Also, Strep A is shared more easily in households where there are children with respiratory infections and skin conditions such as skin sores, scabies and head lice. Healthy living practices cannot be addressed in isolation. Important considerations to improve healthy living practices include culturally appropriate, respectful and practical information and support for reducing risk factors for strep A infections. Strategies must be locally acceptable and feasible. Recommendations include the employment of dedicated Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander environmental health workers in high-risk communities. Environmental health and housing assessment and positive action for people with strep A infections. Collaboration between departments and joint activities are required so that hand and body washing is promoted by school, education and housing sectors and enabling adequate washing facilities for people, clothes, bedding and towels. What is one thing you can do to encourage primordial prevention of ARF? Where increased risk of ARF has been identified because of household crowding or poor household maintenance, contact housing and environmental health practitioners or community groups who can facilitate improved living conditions. 
Primordial Prevention aims to prevent Strep A infections by encouraging healthy living practices, especially washing people and reducing household crowding. Visit the RHD Australia website for more information.